Beth from Balaclava sent me a lovely email saying, Rich Show, tell me all about your favourite cuts of meat. Well, Beth, this is where we start. We start with the rump, which is one of the best cuts of meat. It's quite large and there's lots of different muscles in there, but it does have a little bit more chew to it. But flavour, that's what it's all about. Your rump steak will have a lot of flavour to it. Now, over here, we have another cut, Beth. It's the fillet steak or the tenderloin. Moisture and tenderness is what you get with this cut. The thing to remember with this cut of meat, the tenderloin, is it's more expensive as well, so use it sparingly. Now, of course, here we've got the porterhouse steak, which is your all-rounder. And you can see this porterhouse steak, which has, of course, been grass-fed, has lovely marbling all the way through it, which gives it moisture and flavour, but it's not too big, which is what a lot of people like about porterhouse steak. Now, if you want a bit of both, you can always go to the T-bone steak. And you can see where it gets its name with the T here. But it also has what we call the porterhouse steak here on one side and the fillet on the other, which gives you the best of both worlds. And it also gives you a bone as well to pick up and chew on. Now, a lot of people ask me what sort of cut I like. I would have to say this ribeye or scotch here. They call it ribeye when it's got a bone on it, but it's the scotch which comes from behind the shoulder. And you can see it's got some lovely fat in it which gives it a nice bit of moisture, makes it nice and tender and nice and moist and delicious. Now, of course, I've got my steak on the grill here. I can't wait to tuck into this one.